This is an example of the fishing technique. You see an interesting scene, you essentially wait for kids or people to come up and come up the stairs and uh, you make the photo. So essentially the important thing is when you're shooting in wherever area you are, it's all about positioning. So you essentially want to be patient and wait for the right people to come towards you. So you can see that there's this kind of this nice little staircase here with all these nice curves and leading lines. And so, you know, I was a little bit slow, but I was patient just waiting for people to come up the stairs and walk around here. Or ideally you'd have people come here and they'll walk down and loop around that way. And so you could even see there's different ways you could pre-compose a scene. You could frame it like this and then wait for somebody to come to around here and then click the shower then. Or we could move it around. Now you can see there's the leading line from the top right corner that goes around down here. And then you have the leading line here. Or you could even create more dynamic angles by creating more curves by... When I'm shooting, I always look at the edges of the frame. So you can see the edge the top left corner here, you kind of get that leading line that goes all the way around there. And also you have this edge here. So yeah, um, once you establish your composition, so you can see I'm trying to connect the bottom right corner, the top left corner, and these leading lines here. And you essentially have to be patient and wait for somebody to enter the scene. So ideally there'd be a kid running up here. You could take a photo of them around there, take a photo of them there, or if there's somebody here on the left side coming, they'd swoop around. Unfortunately, this is what you do is just every once in a while you just kind of like look around, see if there's actually any other people about to come down. I'm here at the Kyoto train station. So they call this the fishing technique because if you're a good fisherman, you know how frustrating it could be is that you're looking around, you set out your, um, you set out your, your fishing pole, and you're just patient for people to come and enter, but sometimes you're fortunate, sometimes you're not. So you see this lady here. I'm like, oh, she's, is she gonna come and walk around? It's like, nope. Looks like she's gonna keep shopping. Oh no, oh, it looks like we're lucky she's, she's walking. All right, so I pre-compose the scene. Click, 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 click. Waiting for her to go down, click, 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 click. Click, 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 click. Oh, even people coming down. Oh, and the suit. And essentially, you could just keep walking and tracking him. Hand gestures, him going down. Click, click, click. Follow him. Click, recompose. See the depth and layers. Click, click, click. All right, cool. So it looks like we were actually pretty successful. So yeah, I just realized when it comes to shooting street photography, uh, the fishing technique is good. Is once again, you look for the background, you look for the scenes, you look for the compositions. And yeah, you're just patient for people to come down, walk down, and loop around. Even this would, this would be a pretty good composition here. You could just be patient, stand here and wait. And you could pre-compose the scene. And ideally, in a perfect world, you just wait and then people would start to walk up and then take photos this way. Or if you're up here looking and you're patient, you wait for people to walk down this way. So I'm standing here and I'm waiting and unfortunately the tech, this fishing technique is not the best for me because I'm a quite impatient person. I prefer to run around and take photos instead. Yeah, but we could we could obviously hypothesize, right? So let's say there's some kid here running up the stairs. We'd frame it like this, and we go click, 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 click as they're going up the stairs. And then yeah, the longer you wait, the more patient you are, the better you're gonna be. So be a good fisherman. Uh, shoot a lot. Be patient. Don't give up. Remember, uh, it's not catching the fish which makes uh, fishing enjoyable. It's the process and the designing out. All right, peace out.